Hey everybody, welcome to this week's Friday Office Golf Tip. I'm Matt Hainline, joined with a special guest, Callaway Ambassador, PGA Tour star, Mr. Stuart Appleby. Thanks for joining us today. Um, we got a shot here, it's a pretty tough one. You're on the green, but your ball's close enough to the collar where it's going to affect your stroke. How do you hit this? Well, it sort of looks pretty harmless when you see, well, the ball's on the green, that's all good. But then when you go to place your putter in behind the ball, where you normally would, you're obviously on the green level, but then you've got straight away, you've got maybe a half inch more of a fringe grass sticking up. Now, typically, if you go to stroke it from there, you're going to crash into the fringe and it's going to totally disrupt your rhythm and the, the takeaway. The, really, the only way, two ways to get around it is one, you can squeeze the putter, but that tends to put the ball into a bouncy mode. So it's like a chip and a putt doesn't really work unless it's a long, long, you know, 50, 60 footer. Um, what I like to do is I won't place the club as close as I typically do to the ball. I'll put it on the same level, find the nearest point that's a similar, that's, a, that's the level I've got to cover or clear. That will be at least half an inch to an inch away. Now I know when I take the putter away, it's not obstructed. Now you think, well, that's going to change the impact position a little bit. Yes, it will. The main thing I've got to focus on here, I'm going to have to hit it thin. I won't be able to hit it maybe as centered um, as I normally do. So the putt will be hit quite thin. It'll feel quite strange to the strike. But to have a practice stroke above or next to it that you're going over the high side and that ball's down lower, it's going to feel quite different. You're going to feel like you want to sneak in close. Don't be tempted by it. You need to work on having that consistent takeaway. So this is what basically you want to do is get here and then snag it away, not going to work. This is what you need to do. Place it on the high side, the highest point, line yourself up, take it away and then just going to come through and almost feel like you're hitting it on the head, a little dome. It'll run out beautifully quick. You get such a better strike that way versus trying to chase it in the lower grass. So there you go. Take that shot out to the course next time and you'll play better golf. Thanks, Super, for stopping by. Anytime, man.